Looking back at over three decades of advancing both qualitative and mixed methods research, we asked ourselves one simple question. What makes researchers all around the world choose MaxQDA as their number one research software? And how can we make these great data analysis tools even better? You'll find our answer to this question in MaxQDA 2020, the result of over 30 years of innovation. It builds on existing strengths, but also offers revolutionary new features you won't find anywhere else. Let's have a look. Let's start with one of the oldest and most popular features of MaxQDA, our four window interface, which allows you to import, view, code, and retrieve your data with maximum oversight and flexibility. We've optimized the design on each one of these windows, allowing you to work more effectively and get even closer to your data than ever before. The code system is now adaptive, allowing you to switch easily between frequencies for any selection of your data with just two clicks. In fact, the whole interface gives you far more options and it's much faster to work with thanks to a major usability overhaul that includes dozens of small but important optimizations, such as displaying additional information in new side columns or switching between line and paragraph numbering. Whether you start your research based on a grounded theory approach by using in vivo codes and the new open coding mode, or decide to start off by writing paraphrases or summaries, Max Coutier's roots in research will help you stay on track, no matter your methodological background. Take our memos, for example. We designed them to be just as easy to use as any old school post-it note, meaning you can attach them to any single element of your data with a simple double click. And in MaxQDA 2020, you can now display memos in the new memo sidebar, directly alongside your data. But what good is the ability to attach hundreds of memos anywhere you want if you can't quickly find the right one later on? That's why MaxQDA 2020 features the most comprehensive and intuitive memo management system you'll find anywhere on the market, the new Memo Manager. This new feature lets you search, filter, and create memos quickly and easily allowing you to make sense of your data in your own style of research and without getting lost. Speaking of making sense of your data while not getting lost, we're extremely proud to present the latest edition of our most famous visualization tool, Max Maps. Don't worry, it's still the same module, letting you either mind map freely or create a systematized concept map. But in Max QDA 2020, MaxMaps has six new models and a completely new interface, which gives you a live preview before the concept map gets created. With now up to 14 different models to visualize and analyze your data, MaxQDA 2020 sets a new industry standard for working with concept maps. There are also new import options, a completely new format tab that allows you to style your objects as you see fit, and an array of further improvements that will help you organize your data while keeping everything in sight. Let's take a look at a new visualization feature. Having recently introduced the code map, we're delighted to have built further on that feature and we can now present a new set of visual tools with the all new document map. By combining distance matrices, clustering and a two dimensional workspace, you'll now be able to spot differences and similarities between your cases even more quickly and easily. The same goes for our new paraphrase and summary features which have also been taken to the next level. Once you've paraphrased your data and used your paraphrases to create your new code system, you'll now also be able to compare paraphrases between single cases or entire groups with the new paraphrase matrix. And then the new Summary Explorer allows you to compare summaries for a specific set of codes and documents, giving you far more oversight. And we've got great news for all of you who manage their literature with reference management software like EndNote, Mendeley, or Zotero. You can now transfer your bibliographic information into MaxQDA, including the attached notes, excerpts, and full texts, which MaxQDA then automatically links with their respective reference entries. Transcripts created by automated speech recognition services are becoming better by the day. It's no surprise then that in MaxQDA 2020, the ever-growing list of supported third-party transcription programs got so long that we gave it its own button, 
allowing you to import transcripts from popular transcription services such as Amberscript, Temi, Trint or Rev.com. Sustainable data management and open access are important aspects of research today. Of course, MaxQDA already lets you open and read any MaxQDA project with or without a license by either using the free MaxQDA reader or by using its countless export features. But with MaxQDA 2020, you can now also archive your project's entire dataset, that's including all its external files like audio or video recordings, into one zip file with two simple clicks. And that's it. Those are the highlights of MaxQDA 2020. But there are many more that we didn't have time to mention in this video. So, for a comprehensive overview of all the new features and improvements, with more than 70 in total, visit maxqda.com.